This video will focus on using the Wayside Publishing Learning Site with the Canvas LTI EDU app integration. It will cover the general use of the LTI integration, creating activities, reviewing student submissions, and providing feedback. For information on setting up your Wayside Publishing Learning Site LTI EDU app, please visit the Wayside Publishing Canvas Integrations page to find helpful tutorials and guides. The Canvas LTI integration with the Learning Site is a customizable experience, offering the resources, content, and functionality of the Learning Site, all within a Canvas course. With an LTI integration, the Wayside Learning Site LTI EDU app is added to a course module. The app can be set up to embed the Learning Site within the module or loaded in a new browser tab or window. You can change this setting at any time or add the Wayside Learning Site LTI EDU app to multiple modules. The Wayside Learning Site offers many different instructional resources and activity types. We will focus on creating assignments, reviewing student submissions, and providing feedback for three common digital activity types, tasks, forums, and documents. Task activities include multiple choice, close activities, audio or video recordings, written responses, and more. The classroom forum, unit forums, and forum activities allow for interpersonal communication, sharing learning, adding external content, and extending interaction. Our classroom forum, which is its own link, could also be a great resource for community building and classroom communication. Document assignments are fillable PDFs that can be downloaded, accessed from a URL, or accessed from a content link. They could be completed and submitted digitally or be printed for in-person completion and submission. Let's first focus on assigning and reviewing task activities. Task activities provide multiple attempts for student improvement and can be auto-graded and manually graded on the learning site. To assign a task activity, you will first need to enter the learning site from the LTI EDU app you added to a Canvas module. Next, locate a task you wish to assign. You can do this from the Content tab, the Assignments tab, or using the Compass icon in the Flex text. The Compass icon will take you directly to where the task is located in the Content section of the Learning Site. You can quickly assign a task by selecting the Assign button, and following the prompts. From the Assignments tab, you are able to assign multiple tasks at one time. Once a task is assigned, your students will receive a notification in their notification bell as well as on their Assignments tab. Now, take a moment to review the directions or pause the video to try it out yourself. To review task submissions and provide feedback, you will use the Learning Site Gradebook located on the Grades tab. Auto-graded task scores will appear in the Learning Site Gradebook immediately after submission. Manually graded task scores will appear after a score is entered using the Learning Site's built-in grading and feedback tools. By default, the filters are not all selected. You and your students may want to adjust the filters when you first get started. You can also export your gradebook at any time as a detailed CSV file by selecting Export Grades. You will use the Learning Site Grading and Feedback window to review tasks. In the Grading and Feedback window, you have the ability to provide written, audio, and video feedback to students, adjust grades, remove attempts, navigate between students, see student submission details, and use the highlighting tool on written student work. To review a student's task activity, click on the Grades tab. Then click on the title of the assignment to view all student grades and additional details. Click on the Grade button to open the reviewing window. 
To go directly to the reviewing window from the Grades tab, click on a student's score. You can also access student grades from the individual task in the Content tab. Click on Grades, and then the Grade button to review student submissions and leave feedback. Your students will click on the link on the Grades tab to review their submissions and any feedback you have left. They can also use this link to add evidence to their portfolio. Once you have reviewed student task submissions, you can manually transfer grades from the learning site into your Canvas gradebook. Now let's move on to assigning and reviewing a forum activity. Forum activities encourage interpersonal communication and build classroom community. You can assign a forum activity on the learning site from the Assignments tab or Content tab just like you did with task activities. Select the Assign button and follow the prompts. Once assigned, your students will receive a notification in their notification bell as well as on their Assignments tab. Now, take a moment to review the directions or pause the video to try it out yourself. To view student forum submissions, you can access it easily from the Assignments tab on the Learning site. Click on the title of the activity to view it. Forums can also be accessed from the Content tab, and the Flex Text Compass icon. If you choose to grade a forum activity, manually transfer the grades from the learning site to your Canvas gradebook. Document assignments are fillable PDFs that can be completed and submitted digitally or be printed for in-person completion and submission. There are a few options for assigning and reviewing this type of activity. If you would like students to complete and submit a document assignment digitally, you will need to provide access to the document assignment and create a Canvas assignment that allows for online submissions. One option is to assign the document assignment on the learning site and then create a Canvas assignment that allows for file uploads. Your students will download their completed assignment and upload it to the Canvas assignment. Another option is to provide direct access to the document assignment within a Canvas assignment. You can do this as a link or a file upload. To add a link to your Canvas assignment, first access the document assignment from the learning site. Once open, copy the URL 
and paste it as a link in the Canvas Assignment Directions window. You can also download the document assignment and upload it to a Canvas assignment for student access. After adding the document assignment as a link or an upload, select Online under Submission Type so that your students can upload their completed work. In addition, you could also choose to enable the Canvas Student Annotation Tool, which allows students to annotate PDFs and submit their work directly in Canvas. Check the box to enable student annotation and upload the file that you want students to complete. Now, Take a moment to review the directions or pause the video to try it out yourself. You will review document assignments using the built-in Canvas tools. If your students submitted a document assignment in Canvas, you can review their submissions from either the gradebook by selecting the hyperlink title or directly from the assignment. Then use the built-in Canvas grading tools. If you ever need support, we offer many options. Our help icon, the question mark you see in the top right of the learning site, offers quick access to guides and links to our video tutorials, FAQs, and support center. We also have many ways to contact us, automated chat, email, and phone. I hope this Canvas LTI EDU app integration overview was helpful. If you have any questions or would like more detailed information, please do not hesitate to reach out. Also, be sure to check out and subscribe to our YouTube channel, as well as follow Wayside Publishing on social media. Take care.